Hey everyone, I'm back with another video. It's been a long time, I know, but this time I'm gonna do some Unigen Heaven 3.0 benchmark, but with some crazy GPU settings. I have the core clock or GPU clock clocked at 1270 MHz and the uh, memory at 1800, which is uh, 7200 effective. So, of course, it's water cooled. Here's my setup. So, let's go ahead and run or change the settings first. X them out. Extreme Desolation, 16x Anisotropy. 8x anti-aliasing and system resolution is 1920 by 1080. So let's go ahead and run it. Oh, and I forgot fraps. So let's go ahead. I'll try not to shake the camera so much so nobody complains. Benching. And my CPU is running at four point seven gigahertz at one point four one volts. If anyone is wondering, I'm also going to do uh, a uh, guide, overclocking guide, like a, a fast overclocking guide, not detailed, not so much detailed, but just a fast overclocking guide to stability and how my CPU is stable and what I'm running it at in my settings so be sure to check back later for another video As you can see the FPS up on the left corner doesn't get below 30, 37 or something like this. That's quite good for extreme settings. I benched before I got 57.2 as a result, so we'll see now what I get. And by the way, I'm using the EK water block for the for the graphics card. The injured then for CPU. And up 
we go. I don't know if you can hear the graphics card, but that's it. All always makes sounds when FPS is too high. And yeah, all graphics cards do that actually. <coughs> the ones that I've had have always done that when it's high FPS. When it's 30, it doesn't make any sound, but when it renders a lot of frames per second, it does make a sound. Like, yeah. I don't know what sound that is, but it's rendering too many frames per second. That's the reason. Now we get the boost for the FPS. So, results 56.7 frames per second average, 22.6 minimum, 140.9 maximum, 14.29 score. I've had 14.14 as my maximum score when I ran it yesterday, but yeah, I'll post a picture after this. So yeah, before I finish the video, or I yeah finish the video, I'm gonna show you the temperature. So the maximum temperature was 53 Celsius, and yeah, as you can see here, maximum memory and call clocks yeah so thanks for watching and be sure to check back for a overclocking guide quick one so thanks for watching